What's up friends? Welcome back to the channel. Thank you for joining me here again. Today, super excited, finally starting Breaking Bad. I've been waiting to watch this show for a long time. Happy I can do it for the channel. Super stoked to get into it, especially based off how highly all of you talk about it. A lot of you say it's your favorite show of all time, so I cannot wait to get stuck into it. If you're new here, I'm going to be doing these episodes every Tuesday and Thursday, obviously until I finish the show. So that's when you can expect to see uploads for this. And the full reactions to these episodes will of course be up on my Patreon with the link in the description if you're interested. A lot of times those full reactions will be up before the YouTube edits. So if you'd like to get those videos early, that's where you'll be able to find that. But I don't really know a whole lot about this series. I will say about six years ago, 2014, I watched the first two episodes because I was kind of interested in seeing what it was about, but I didn't go any farther past that. And so during the first two episodes, I might remember a couple of small scenes or details. Don't really remember very much about it. I know it stars Brian Cranston, who I've liked him and what I've seen him in before, whether it's shows like Malcolm in the Middle, obviously a very different tone, or movies like Godzilla or things like that. I've always appreciated his acting. I always thought he's a great actor, so it'll be great to see him in a long-running drama series. And besides him as Walter and Jesse, I know as the other main character, I don't really remember any of the names from the first two episodes let alone I don't know any characters in the future episodes so I'm really excited to watch through this and I hope you're excited to watch through it with me and if you're new definitely consider subscribing I do movie TV show reactions several times a week and for those of you who are already subscribed and returning I appreciate your support so much looking forward to interacting with you throughout this series can't wait to get into it so without wasting any more time let's start breaking bad I'm so stoked for this this. I don't know if anything's been as hyped up for me before as Breaking Bad is. My man just driving in his underwear. The best way to drive if you ask me. I like that it just starts off with this because you know you're just in for a wild ride because I do remember from when I watched this episode and if you skipped the beginning the intro I mentioned that I'd seen the first two episodes six years ago 2014 I do remember that this is like a teaser of what happens at the end of this first episode Walter Jr. you're my big man I just want you to know I only had you in my heart. Man, great performance already right from the get-go. This dude's ready to risk it all. Such a cool intro. And I don't remember why he's ready to risk it all there at the end. Don't remember what leads him to that point. Obviously, Brian Cranston had been in like shows like Malcolm in the Middle and a few other things like that. Was he... Did Breaking Bad kind of make him more of a household name than he was? Or was he already kind of well known? Dang, so he's way smart. Happy birthday. Oh, he's 50. It's over the hill. <coughs> Did you take your echinacea? No. I, I want real bacon. No, not this fake crap. Too bad. Just your normal family. Normal issues. It is the study of what? Oh, it looks like such a fun classroom. Got so much space. Molecules change their bonds. <laughs> That's cool. Elements, they combine and change into compounds. I like his passion. You can see the excitement in him for the subject. I'm gonna run the register. I'm gonna know. We talked about this. I'm short-handed, Walter. What am I to do? Dang, that's rough to have to have two jobs, one be teaching high school and the other to be washing cars or working at a car wash. Make those tires shine, huh? Oh my god. <laughs> you would not believe he's cleaning Chad's car. Man, I really dislike that kid already. I mean, you're flat as a washboard. Oh. <laughs> you look awesome. She's not showing at all, is she? She's showing a little. Oh, so she's pregnant. I'm proud to say the outstanding professionalism of my 
fellow agents at the Albuquerque district office resulted in a so his brother-in-law is a cop taken off the streets that's sad everyone's watching that when it's his party which was well organized hey how much money is that uh, it's about 700 grand that's a lot of cash it's easy money so we catch you well just say the word and uh, I'll take you on a ride along something Oh man, the seed is planted. Mm. Oh hey, so what's up for Saturday? Mm, car wash. Mm. Don says he needed me. Is this the adult life I get to look forward to just doing that with having while having a normal conversation? Mm. They they really setting up a quite a mundane lifestyle. Shoot, what just happened to him? Do you just have a heart attack? Mr. White, are you a smoker? No, never. Why do you ask? Does he have lung cancer? Like I said, I remember some scenes, but I don't remember basically anything from the first two episodes. You understood what I've just said to you. Lung cancer, inoperable. Dang, it is lung cancer. I'm sorry. I just need to make sure you fully understand. That's terrible. That's got to be one of the worst things, learning that you have cancer. Especially if it's like that, where there's nothing you can really do. So, how was your day? I don't know. It was, um... Surely he's got to tell her. It's fine. Dang, man, you can't keep her waiting on something like that. Are you here to work or to be staring at the skies? Come on, let's go. You bugged up. What? Oh. <laughs> My man has had enough. Dang, so I'm assuming that's one job down. Can't blame the outburst too much. It's got to change your whole outlook on life and what you're doing. So, what tells you it's a meth lab? Star Snitch. Says uh, some dude goes by Captain Cook. Lives up to his name in there. Captain Cook. Fun fact, there was a real life meth lab going on a few apartments down from me like five years ago. Now that I think of it, I think that was the reason that I actually started the first two episodes of this show because after that there was the meth lab like right next to me. I'm like, well, might as well see what this is all about. Ouch. <laughs> oh, it's Jesse. Oh, he knows him. Shoot, that's the last person Jesse needed to spot him then if he already knew him. How'd you find me? You're still in our filing system. Your aunt owns this place, right? Oh, so is he like a former student? There's a lot of money in it, huh? I don't know what you're talking about. I'm thinking maybe you and I could partner up. Dang, he's taking the leap straight into it. Guess if he sees the opportunity, might as well try it. It would seem that Jesse agreed to his proposal then. He's definitely set up pretty well to make a start in the business if he's a chemistry teacher. Got access to uh, lots of stuff. I like how non-showy the cinematography has been so far. It definitely adds to the feeling of normalcy or mundane lifestyle. What the hell is this? Lab safety equipment. We're also going to have an emergency eyewash station. These chemicals and their fumes are toxic, in case you didn't know that. A chemistry teacher cooking meth is certainly an interesting concept. Definitely a fascinating premise. Dude, this isn't even seven grand. All right, my guy wants 85. This is all the money I have in the world. You're a drug dealer. Negotiate. <sighs> That's so risky putting all your life savings into this, especially giving it to a meth dealer. No way you could trust him fully with that. If you've gone crazy or depressed, I'm, I'm just saying, that's something I need to know about, okay? I mean, that, that affects me. Brian Cranston's obviously great, but I really like Aaron Paul's acting as well. He's got a great personality that fits the character well, I feel like. Only been a few interactions so far, but he's made an impression for sure. <laughs> Don't. What? <laughs> Don't. Walt! So did Walt just dip out? Is he just really afraid of any sort of confrontation? Loaf in my brand new big boy oh no, he's coming back. 
<laughs> Whoa! What are you doing? What's wrong, Chief? Having a little trouble walking? I love it, man. Stepping into action. Walt is a changed man. <laughs> you felt that rush a little bit. <laughs> oh, shoot. I like the frantic editing style for this sequence. That's some stone fine tick tick you've been cooking there, I said. How about you come work for me? I'd be willing to sell it to you if, if the price is right. Whoa, getting some mad stacks right off the bat. He was there when I got busted. He's with the DEA. You an artist. It's a damn shame. Wait, I'll teach you my recipe. You let us both live and I will teach you. Yes. Talk your way out of it. Cutting it close there, but man's speech level is 100. Is this gonna screw him up though, having someone else know his recipe? Cause then wouldn't they have competition? Cause they would just start making the same stuff? Oh. Shoot, is he straight gassing him out? Dang, Walter knows how to think on his feet. It just keeps getting worse. Here we are, back at the beginning. That was a dope shot. I don't know how they did that. It was just like a zoom out or a dolly or what? Whoa! I did not remember he tried to do that. Some divine intervention right there, man. Can't believe he was ready to just end it all like that. Oh, it's the fire truck for the fire, not the cops. Walter's still in business. You gotta clean this up. <laughs> what an unlikely duo those two are. I like it as a pilot episode. Definitely gets you interested in seeing the rest. And after watching that part, I think or, I mean, the part is in the episode. I think that may have been the only one I watched. I don't actually know if I did see the second one because that pretty much covered everything that I remembered. Guess we'll find out soon enough. All right, so episode one of Breaking Bad in the books. I love it as an intro episode. It works great. Great introduction to you, the various characters, whether it's Walt or Jesse or his family i thought it was all really done well and it's surprising how much they cover in such a short amount of time because i feel like with all of the introductions they had to do we still accomplished a lot story-wise and we get through a lot of plot and things like that so they definitely handle the storytelling well in making sure you're continuously engaged as a viewer and as an audience there's definitely a lot of great stuff that it throws at you a lot of various twists and turns i like seeing the different elements of walt's character in that how he's somewhat timid a little bit unsure of himself but he also has some tendencies to be more strong and assertive when he needs to be so i like that about his character it'll be interesting to see how he develops over the series as well as jesse who's definitely the more confident one but he isn't as knowledgeable or doesn't have the life experience and so he's a little bit more reckless or wild definitely an interesting family dynamic as well because there's a lot of issues going on whether it's his lung cancer that he discovers their finances which aren't too great despite him working the two jobs or his son who's I, i'm guessing it is cerebral palsy is what he has and then another baby on the way so definitely a lot of interesting elements to his family which i'm sure will come into play more frequently and i just find the overall premise really cool and very unique definitely the only show really of its kind i feel like haven't seen any other show that ta tackles a topic quite like this or just tackles a topic like this in general nothing that i've seen has handled it and so this is a fun idea that they had i don't know if the show itself follows kind of the same story 
of making meth or whatever for the whole show or if it's just the season or whatever obviously don't tell me i'll find out for myself from what the show says but definitely excited to learn more about the main two characters more about the other side characters not sure who will be a major piece again with character stuff uh, I appreciate when you guys share on movies and stuff different information or backstory about the characters for the show it's a little different I don't really want to know about the characters either how they progress or what episodes they're in or anything like that I just kind of want to experience for myself and so if on these Breaking Bad episodes if I don't interact as much in the comments it's probably just because I don't want to risk seeing any potential spoilers or anything like that so I'll definitely still interact where I can but if you see less response on these that's the only reason just because I want to preserve the genuine experience as much as I can but if you watch this video up to this point thank you so much hope you enjoyed seeing my reaction to episode one of season one of Breaking Bad really looking forward to going on this journey especially with all of you if you enjoyed it definitely consider leaving a like on the video definitely helps the channel grow helps the video reach more people but i'm looking forward to the next episode but until the next video i will see you all later peace